Or it could be a, a humongous snake. That, that works too. Maybe that's for the best. Nobody likes poop in the pool. But anyway, this is the Osohei snake. This is the boss of chapter two. Man, I, this chapter has flown flown by like so quickly and Kum Kumatora only has one HP. Okay, um, yeah, we should probably get on that. Nut bread, why not? Because I'm getting real tired of these mother fruitin' snakes in this monkey fighting pool. Now, as you might guess, this, um, this water snake is weak to, to thunder, which is which is nice if um, Kumatora has gotten to a high enough level to learn Thunder Alpha. Or you could just have a crap of the Thunder Bombs. You could come back, go back to that crossroads, then go back to, work, to Duster's house to get a bunch of Thunder Bombs to save. But I think that would just take too much time. And see, 87 damage. Or you could just have Wes throw Thunder Bombs. That works too. Uh, might as well lower his, his defense. Just to make this go by a little quicker. Make sure I don't I don't die in this episode. I've gone a whole episode without dying, and I want to keep that streak going. Don't worry about Kumatora's safety. I think she's she got everything handled. Well, as long as she has me to heal her, but still. Just thunder. Oh no! You bastard! Threw one of Duster's socks. <laughs> that reminds me of um of that one part in Earthbound when you fight the Kraken. And um and the sailor says that he threw his socks at the at the Kraken while you're fighting him. <laughs> Can you please start moving Kumatora? That would be really helpful. And it would be really helpful if I use my thunder bombs. Cause dust is bringing the thunder. Ow. A secret thief arp technique. There we go. That's helpful. And we'll just heal Kumatora just in case. Come on. Can you please die? Or you... Oh, no, don't <laughs> accidentally speed up. As you can see, he does this giant tidal wave attack. But that causes him to, to see, like sink into the water. And that makes him... Incapable of attacking for a few turns. Um, can we? Do we have any more healing items? No, we don't. What? Yeah, we'll just use the sprinting bomb, and we we'll use a beef jerky on Duster. See, <laughs> that does a lot of damage. Making lots of bubbles. Yeah, probably because you stink so much. I don't know. As whatever. Oh. What what did I do with Thunder again? I forgot. Just attack. And Thunder. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised that, that Thunder is hitting this much. Because as you if you played um the Mother series before, Thunder has a has a big tendency of, of missing a lot, especially in Earthbound. But in this game it has a it seems to have a slightly better chance of hitting, but it's still impressive to see it, like, hit this much. <laughs> um, you just do Running Bomb. Let's see if Kumatori can pull off a life up on herself. Or we could, we could just kill it. Ha <laughs> ha! In your face! And Duster is level 18. Kumatora is level 13? She's all within level 13? Wow. I should be paying attention more. Wait, what's happening? Is it... Did the snake pull the drain on... On the lake? Or something? Or was... Or was his tail... Serving as a... Like a, a stopper for the lake? Or... I'm not gonna get too much into that. It seems like we're fine. We're, we seem to be wet and stinky, but we're fine. No, don't quit speeding up. S stupid. 
And we're back at Duster's house. Looks like lighter and fuel helped us out. But seems like we're missing something. I can't put my finger on it. How can you tell if she, that she's tough if she was just knocked out? Like out of the out of the lake or the river. <laughs> Thanks, fuel. Thank you. Oh yeah, Duster! I forgot about him. Well, that's... That's not good. <laughs> this damn merry time. <laughs> Getting washed down river. I think I've got plenty of rest when I was unconscious, thank you. Oh, look, we have Kumatori in the front of our party. I actually think this is the only time that you that you have Kumatora, Kumatora at the front of your party, which is kind of cool. And he's she's just being followed around by Wes. Oh, what are you? Um, you could say that. Wink, wink. You could say that. Wink, wink, wink. <laughs> oh, what's? going on with this fat fuck? It's scum bucket? It must mean chum bucket? You're SpongeBob! You're spending all me money! <laughs> I'm sure Duster was just doing what you said! Well, we have, like, in it tea and crap. What if they're thirsty and they just stole that? Oh, you tell us, bitch ass. <laughs> the thieves? Hey, Duster is a gentleman thief, thank you. <laughs> Stranger danger. Hey, Flint is talking again. Ah, uh, Flint's words. It's like a mix of Fergie and Jesus. Yeah, I haven't listened to them, so I wouldn't really know. I don't think Duster is coming back anytime soon. It's just a, a guess, though. <laughs> Such concerning words from old man Wes. And here is the, the epilogue to Chapter 2. The mysterious group that has been tinkering with the forest creatures in an almost toy-like fashion has finally commended, commenced his plan. Commenced its plan to alter the, alter the town, the lives, and even the hearts of the people. It seems... I can't even see the words. It seems as if a grand scheme of some sort is hidden behind the actions of a suspicious peddler who has recently arrived. However, not everyone is content to sit quietly by, quietly by as the enemy continues its something attacks from any, every angle. Flint, whose family bonds were torn to shreds. Wes and his son Duster, the thieves of justice. Princess Kumatora, the mysterious girl who suddenly appeared. Destiny is bringing together those who would use their power for good. What has become of Lucas, the crybaby? <laughs> yeah, I'll just throw Lucas into the mix for no reason at all. I don't remember he's just running off. That's about it. And, I believe that's the end of chapter 2, yeah. I can't believe how fast this chapter went by. It just seems like I... It just seems like it was just yesterday that I died about five times. Man. Those were the days, I tell you. But anyway, we're going to record our rec recordness. And this, I guess, this is the end, <laughs> the end of the video. So, this has been Super Paper Ness, signing off. I will see you guys in Chapter 3.